What's up everybody? It's your boy Coach Turbo and I'm back again with another video to help keep somebody healthier, to help somebody get out of pain, to help somebody just get some pain relief, whether you are a athlete or just a general population person, okay? So today, before we get started, you know what time it is. Go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel, like this video and comment on this video and share this video with someone because you might help save someone's low back and core today okay so today i wanted to show you guys a little bit of exercises that you can do for home to develop core strength but to also give you some more information on why you may be experiencing some pain in your lower back and maybe your core okay so a lot of people have low back problems they could have some pain in their hips, whether it's front side or back side, and this could be a variation of things, right? Um, there's nothing specific because everyone has different things that they do and take part in different activities on a day-by-day -day basis. So with a lot of those activities, we get put in bad positions in which we adjust or get used to, which then puts our spine, hips, and our low back in a position of creating pain, of creating aches, and so on. So a lot of us can have pain in our low back and our hips due to weak core, poor mobility and flexibility, and just kind of poor strength that's kind of supporting this area here, okay? So today, I wanted to show you guys some strength exercises that you can do from home that can help with repositioning, that can help with strength and that can help take some pain away and to help give you guys a little bit of relief so you can enjoy some of the things that you do okay so the first one that we're going to come into here is a progressional exercise which everyone knows called a shoulder tap so we'll start at a basic progression so i go down on both my knees i'm going to extend out from my hips and me or maintain a nice flat back so this is just the first level for this exercise here so we're just going to hold this position okay so we'll hold that position for about two sets of 30 seconds and that's just realigning my hips um getting good core engagement to make sure all of the muscles supporting this area are being turned on and activated a stronger core helps to keep my spine nice and stable and keep me nice and tall with my posture as well so to progress from that position, right, we'll just go ahead and we'll just lift at the knees and we'll hold this position here. Notice how I'm nice and flat and parallel to the ground, right? And we'll hold that position for about two sets of 30 seconds. The next way you can progress that drill is by standing tall and then adding a shoulder tap into the exercise. Again, you can do two sets of 30 seconds or you can go two sets of 20 where you do 10 right and 10 left. Next exercise here, again, which will be phenomenal to help you guys with realignment, okay? And that's a big issue where people lose a lot of function as they grow older. So, for this exercise, you guys will just need a ball just like so. Um, you can get these balls at Amazon or kind of any sports store, Walmart, or anything like that, this is where you can get one of these. So, from here, I'm gonna lay down on my back. I'm gonna place both of my hands at the top of the ball. Then I'm gonna drive my knees, keep my knees in a 90 degree position. And I'm gonna drive and hold until I feel a lot of tension start to build up in my core. So, I'll hold this position and then I'll relax. So we'll go for about two sets of 30 seconds with that same exercise. If you don't have a ball like this, you'd have to get a ball like this, right? There's no kind of getting around um, this exercise here, but get a ball like this at any Walmart, um, Amazon or anything like that. They're pretty cheap, so you can get a couple good ones for relatively cheap. Next exercise. Right? So I like to isolate one side of my body, especially when I'm doing some core work, it gives me the ability to see if I'm balanced or if I need some type of correction when it comes to my posture, strength, and my torso realignment. So next exercise, I grab my roller. I'll drive one side into the roller as I start in that position. 
Then I'll extend out, come back, extend out, come back, extend, and come back, right? So that exercise, we're gonna do that for about 10 reps each side. Um, and again, you can increase your sets and reps as you guys go through your weeks and progress through these exercises. Um, but that's just a little information and what causes some low back pain, right? So reposition well, get good core strength, keep the muscles surrounding the hip strong so we can maintain a leveled pelvis and continue to do your core work, okay? So again, subscribe to the YouTube channel, like this video, comment under this video and share with someone. Okay, follow me on Instagram at Turbo Spawning. I'll be back with another video for you guys. Boom.